Hey YouTube. I uh, gotta set up this camera here. Hope we got this over. Um, gonna be doing a review of the uh, HFC Cougar G2 gas blowback. My other review is more of a funny joke video. So I'm gonna separate them somehow. Um, well, yeah, let's do this. This is my most recent sidearm. Here's the box on evite.com. It'll cost you 110 bucks. If it says a 14 millimeter threading on it, it doesn't. Only the cheap little orange tip does, and that thing will go flying off. And no, you can't super glue it on. It'll break off. That's what happened to mine. So don't do it. All right. Um. It is a M9, technically in real life. I believe it is. This blowback is full metal. It's capable of shooting in fully automatic, as well as. Ooh, 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 that's not good. That's not good. It can't be good for my camera. Let me prop the camera up on the magazine. That might work. All right. Have um, magazines hold 16 rounds. It's a gas blowback. Every time you shoot, the slide will come back. It's quite a bit of force. When you're out of ammo, the slide will lock back like this. It's a very real sounding slide rack. Slide. Let's see? There's a little bit of kick. I mean, not kick, kick. Like, it's not that accurate because it kind of moves around in your hand. But in full, <laughs> I just realized my joke. Um, in full auto, it's not that accurate. But if you're a sniper, um, you could definitely mow down some enemies charging you. On uh, semi, it's pretty accurate. It's just using .25s in it. You get relatively short range, but awesome accuracy. You can really nail somebody. And. Uh, I got uh, three mags for it. One in the gun, one here. The other one's behind the camera. So it comes in a pretty nice case. The latch and mine came broken, but I fixed it. Um, as you can see, it's kind of lubed up with a uh, high grade silicon oil, P Force. Um, as you can see, injection port opens. It doesn't have adjustable hop up. Um, I don't believe it does. It doesn't. Um, I didn't upgrade KJW steel sided barrel for this. It does not fit in this gun. Don't try it. Orange strip came out pretty easily with a pair of pliers. If you break your gun pulling on it, it's not my fault. Um, basically. It's a really nice gun. I played one game with it. I played one or two games with it. Um, it's been summer. We don't play in the summer, really. I mean, me and my friends don't really play in the summer. So, actually, my friend, you'll see my other reviews, especially my joke review. T Max Throwdown with Kyle. On YouTube, he's T Max Throwdown. Xbox Live, he's Airsoft. You know how to spell Airsoft. Um, space Slong. S L O N G. I know it's spelled wrong. Xbox Live won't allow it. I wonder why. <laughs> but, uh, as you're laughing about that, my gun. Um, the sweet gun. No accuracy tests coming. I guess some guns are different on the fire selector. Um, here's safety. Let me try to flip in the safety. That's safety. Over the red dot. When it's covering up FA, full auto. And SA, semi auto. Um, uh, gun has a working hammer, double action. Works great. The sights are pretty small. Um, I think you guys can see those. Not really sure. I think you guys got it. Might be kind of blurry. Anyways. Um, you might want to pick up some white paint and a really tiny brush. 
to paint their sights white. That would be a really good idea. I haven't done that yet. Um, other than that, it's a cool spider logo on the grips. It is full metal, believe me. Grips are kind of cheap plastic in my opinion, but the rest of the gun is full metal. And that's not a joke either. This is plastic too, I think. I'm not sure. This little piece. The rest is full metal. Fits your hand great. Accurate. Swapping mags is easy. 16 round mags. Usually get about 25 shots from uh, gas fill. It's kind of a gas guzzler. Three, 280 to 310 FPS. Made by HFD. Awesome gun. Go pick one up. Uh, off Evike for 110. Great deal. Don't know about other websites. I only suggest Evike. Um, Ekim12 signing off. Uh, subscribe, rate, request, and uh, watch my other videos. See ya.